Rakesh Masala Private Limited was established at a very small scale with limited resources in hand. Progressing gradually, the company's turnover has crossed the figure mark of 200 crore rupees. Accredited for its top quality aromatic spices, the brand is all set to win over hearts across North India. Endorsing their tradition of maintaining high quality product standards, in 2015, the Rakesh Group embarked a giant leap at their Kanpur factory unit by instituting North India's first and only mixing and grinding plant that is propelled by cryogenic technology with a capacity of producing 2 ton spices per hour. This fully automatic giant plant requires minimal human interference which in turn helps in maintaining high product quality with maximum hygiene. Equipped with cryogenic technology, this technical marvel has proven itself exemplary and has set a precedence for the spice producing companies across North India. Let us get familiar with this mixing and grinding plant's work process. First of all, the sacks containing cleaned raw material are brought to the bag transfer belt conveyor and from there the raw material is transferred to the bag dump station, the place from where the raw material enters the plant. Thereafter, passing through the inclined cleated belt conveyor and then through the dual tunnel diverter 1, the raw material reaches hammer mill 1 where the first level crushing process begins. Next, the crushed raw material is transferred to the hammer mill 2, where it is further finely trampled to the desired level. After this process, the finely crushed material is filtered through the reverse jet filter cyclone and enters the continuous mixer, where it is mixed with liquid nitrogen. When released from the main storage unit, the liquid nitrogen is at a temperature of minus 194 degrees Celsius. As it passes and travels through the pipes of the plant to be sprayed on the crushed material, its temperature ranges between minus 140 to minus 194 degrees Celsius. Cold grinding with cryogenic technology and mixing liquid nitrogen helps in retaining the aroma and essential oils in the spices. After getting mixed with liquid nitrogen, the material enters universal mill where it is finely ground. After this process, the pulverized material passes through the cyclone and enters the rotary sifter where it is filtered as per the desired parameters and transferred to the bulk loader and the oversized material is sent back to the rotary sifter for desired grinding. Moving from the rotary sifter, the ground material enters the batch hopper. Here the material is digitally weighed and accordingly transferred to the vertical mixer where other desired ingredients are added in it. After passing through this process, the spice becomes completely ready and it is discharged and filled in the IBC containers and sent to the packaging plant via forklifts. At the packaging plant, spices are categorized weighed and accordingly packed in sachets and boxes and sent to the market. And here it is, Rakesh Masala, ready to add ecstatic taste and delicious flavour to your recipes. Pamper your taste buds and rule your hearts as well as the kitchen.